Hey, today I'm going to show you how to use Echo Studio 8. It's not that hard, once you get to know it really. So today I'll just give you a quick tutorial on how to use it. Okay, first down here you have a folder called Packs, if you just open that. And then, choose Hip Hop, you have all these kicks, hi-hats, basses, snares. Just pick any hi-hat you like any kick you like and any snare you like and just drag it onto there okay now once you've done that you just right click where it says hi-hats and click fill each two steps and that will put on every second step if you press play it will sound like this Now I'm just going to show you a really simple beat and then you can add stuff into it yourself. So on with kick I'm just going to put one there, one there, okay, and then snare on the start of every red section. If you click play again it will sound like very simple. So say if you wanted to add more kicks you could add one maybe here and here and maybe even one here okay. now if you're back into packs and go into dance you have this here you have two so choose the second one with this orange little I can't buy it. Drag that on. And where it says pat up here, that means pattern. Put that up to number two. So you're on to the next one. Then right click and piano roll. And I see you have a piano here, which is just all the notes. <laughs> This grid here that you see, if you make sure that's on either set or line, it doesn't really, really matter which one. Just make sure it's on one of them. Okay, now I'm not going to make a complicated one because I can't really. So I'll just show you how to use it, then you can go and practice and make your own better ones. So maybe if I wanted to start with C6 here, just no, I should start. C5. Okay, and put there to no one here, one here, and then Okay, that's really simple and it probably won't even sound good, but this is only a quick tutorial and you can work on one yourself. And if you go into the series here at the top, well, I'll click on the first one and it'll bring up this grid. And on this one, where it says pattern one, pattern two, pattern three. That's these here that you've already made. Okay, so if you remember, pattern one was the drum beat. So if you put, just click them on pattern one, just click two for now. And then if you want to pattern two, remember that was like the dance synth thing. So we just put them on as well. Now if you click here, song, because at the moment that will just play. <laughs> So if you click song here, okay, and then play. And because I've taken no time and haven't thought about it whatsoever, that sounds really bad. But 
you can always change it. So. <laughs> have something called channel presets okay second one down if you click that and then where it says the 3x OC SC click that and then you have all these sounds here too I kind of like the death ray one so if you bring up this here again there's no you might not like that at all so you might change it to death ray they just drag it on top of it and the pattern will still be there then try it, it will sound like Okay, but my speakers are really crap, so my speakers aren't really handling that very well. Okay, so you can go and make your own stuff and hopefully have some good songs. Okay, thank you for listening.